do you think uh, it's going so far? Better than last week. Hey guys, welcome to another video. So we have another driving lesson with Taz today, and um, this is going to be Taz's seventeenth driving lesson. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So uh, Taz is uh, taking lessons, and she's using the ultimate driving course, and we're we're filming her progress from her first lesson up to now, and uh, hopefully we can continue uh, until the day you pass your test. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. And um, so last lesson, Taz, what did we do? We did right turns on roundabouts. Yeah, we started off with right turns on roundabouts, yeah. and how did they go? They went well. Yeah, they were, they were, you started doing them independently, didn't yeah. you? Yeah. Okay, and then once they went okay, obviously we changed the route a bit, and then we said let's um, do, obviously, do the stuff that you've done before, like continuing straight ahead at roundabouts and dual carriageways, crossroads. And then what happened? How did that go? Um, it went bad. Because I started stalling, going into the wrong lanes. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we, well, it, it could have been much better, yeah. Like, you've done that stuff before, and you've done it okay. But last lesson, like you said, um, a lot of stalling. But like I said, it's your first lesson with this. Yeah. yeah. In this car. And then um, the lane discipline, yeah. Sticking to your lane. So when going, when we go straight ahead, which lane are you supposed to use? Left. Yeah. And if, we're, if we start off in the left lane, which lane should you stay in? The left. And what were you doing? I'm going into the right lane. And why is that dangerous? Because if there's cars who are like actually in the right lane come behind us. Then I see. Yeah. Okay. So today's lesson, shall we continue doing like, you know the stuff that you've done before? Should we do quite a few roundabouts, dual carriageways, some right turns? Yeah. Yeah. Um, our crossroads as well, because I'm on a crossroad you stole last, last week as well, yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. And we'll work on that. Look on that, um, clutch yeah, clutch and g gas as well, yeah. So last lesson, I was like, I spent a lot of time saying more gas, more yeah. gas, yeah, okay. So, um, even when we move off here, we'll just uh, try the gas a bit, yeah, okay. And, um, yeah, um, so last lesson, did ask you to recap on the videos in the yeah. ultimate driving course because you did say to me that you hadn't really, you've obviously watched the videos, but you hadn't watched them again for a while, yeah, so, mm -hmm. um, did you get time to watch the videos? Yeah. Good. Yeah. So you've recapped on some of the videos. Yeah. Um, and we'll, we'll see how it goes today then, yeah. So basically today's um, aim of the lesson is to basically build up on last week's and obviously sort out the problems we were having. Yeah. So improve on our gas and clutch. Um, make sure you're more confident, like obviously moving off a bit quicker. And... Um, Roundabout, sticking to your lanes, yeah. Mm -hmm. So just driving general to make sure we are on a decent level with yeah. everything you learned before, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. So yeah, hopefully <coughs> by the end of the lesson we'll we'll uh, we'll improve on that, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So help wise, um, should we start off with me helping you off with the gas again? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Just obviously reminding you of the gas. Will that be enough? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just just that. And on the roundabouts. Would you like me to talk you through which lane to stay in, or just to remind you? Um, just to remind me. Okay, so yeah. so a lot of reminding, a lot of questioning. Yeah, yeah. we'll see how that goes. Yeah? yeah. Okay. And obviously, if you're still not getting there, I, I can start obviously fully talking through stuff as well. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. Um. So yeah, I'll be helping you with that. Anywhere else where you're gonna need my help? Um. Could I? You know, like we're not actually going onto the round about the judgment. Could yeah. I just say to you, like, oh, is it okay for me to go now? And then you can just like, tell me. Okay. Um, so I have it on the approach around. Rachel, I'll just question you on that then yeah. as well. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Anything else? Junctions. Um, uh, T junctions. Anywhere else you need my help? I don't think so. No. Cool. Hope not. That's fine. So whenever you're ready, start the car for me. Okay. So moving off from here, yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's just try. Pressing a bit more gas, yeah. Jump to actually go. Yeah, yeah. Actually, move, move off, yeah. I just remember to use the gas correctly. See, before we did our observations, what were we supposed to do? So what's Set the, the gas first? Yeah, what's the routine that we use for moving off? Um, mirror. No. Prepare. The, yeah. This remember this is in the first video this is the first on one. your first lesson. So you do so do it, but let's see if you prepare, remember the routine. Good, prepare. Mirrors, and then no. So what was the routine called? The three letter routine. MSN. No, no, MSN means for stopping. Okay, give me two seconds. 
P. Good. P. M. M is the last one. There's another letter in the middle. How? So think about it. So you know what did that prepare so, stand? What did that P stand for? Prepare. Good. So preparing. Have you done that now? Yeah. Good. And what do you do after you prepare? Signal. No. Check all mirrors. That's it. And what is that called when you check your mirrors and your blind spots? What's Look. that called? Yeah. Observations. Yeah. Yeah. And so and that was the O. P O M. Yeah. That's it. We got there. <laughs> we got there eventually. See, you do it. Yeah, you do it. It's not like it's not like really vital that you remember every single routine. Yeah. Okay. As long as you're doing it correctly. Mm -hmm. You understand? And there, you didn't prepare the car fully. Yeah. Right. Okay. And why is it important to prepare first before you observe? Um, so that you're ready, like, and like, say if you like look and then prepare, and then go, like, you observe, like, your surroundings can change. Brilliant, brilliant. Ready? Yeah. So, remember the gas now. Good. Okay, so remember when we were off here, yeah? Remember how to use the gas. Then, good. Is that going to help you? It's going to allow me to move off quicker. Yeah, and pr prepare, prepare the, the car, car, yeah. Good. So, look, we're in the left lane now, yeah? Okay. And which lane are you going to use? The left lane. What would happen if, as you enter the roundabout, you moved over to the right? P. 
people could think that Clutch we're... down a little bit. That's the clutch is too high there. Yeah. Okay. So take your feet again, please. People could think that we're going in a different direction. Yeah, and also, if you do be accidentally and there's a car there... You could hit into that. So. Okay. Remember the gas. A bit more test. So remember your lane position. Good. Stop braking and slowing down too much if the lights are green. Yeah, so you don't want to speed up towards it. Yeah, mm -hmm. okay. But your foot would stay on the brake then. You know, and said a bit more gas. Yeah. Because yeah? if you start slowing down too much, why well, is that not good? Then you're gonna slow down everyone else behind you as well. That's it. Everyone's gonna be expecting you to slow down for like from green lights. It's good anticipating. Yeah, that they might change. Too, really. Yes. Good. So here on a dual carriage, you look within the left lane, yeah? Mm -hmm. You wouldn't accidentally just, like, drift over to that lane, would you? No. Maybe they're checking your mirrors and signalling and just making sure it's safe. Same on the, same on the round, I bet, yeah? Mm -hmm. Remember how to use the gas when we move off here, yeah? It's been good so far. to use the gas. Remember which lane as well. Brilliant. Which gear? Good. Okay, if you can turn right at these traffic lights. Is it safe? Yeah, yeah move over now, it's fine. Good. 
if you could keep to the left lane, that's the only thing to you. Cuts your signal, please. Okay, so there, yeah. You know when you did your mirrors signal, you're checking your mirrors again, yeah? Mm -hmm. There was a safe gap, yeah? Yeah. And you were a bit hesitant, you didn't take it, then this, then that black car turned up, yeah? Yeah. But he was still, he wasn't like, He's gaining on, yeah? He was still holding back, yeah? Mm -hmm. And which mirror out of the, the two mirrors, yeah? The, well, your three mirrors, gives you a true picture of uh, how far something is. Centre mirror. Centre mirror, yeah. So use that a bit more to, to assess the distance. So yeah, both these lanes go to the right, yeah. Whatever made you select the left one, do you think? Because of the right's for the whole take. Good. And which lane are we going to end up in now? Left. That's it. Which lane do you stay? Good. That's just like on the roundabout, yeah. Okay, start off in the left. Keep to the left. If you're using that one, you stick to the right, then make sure you move back over. Yeah. yeah, because what's that right turn lane for? Um, is it for overtaking and turning right? I see. Yeah, yeah. good. So is there anyone behind us? Yeah. Are they keeping a the safe gap? Yeah. What can happen to the lights ahead now? They're good. Go ahead. I see. Just maintain the speed. Yeah. Let's. Don't break too much. I see. And continue now. See there, when you do that, that close, yeah, okay, we should make a decision that obviously it would be unsafe to stop at that speed, yeah, especially if the road surface is wet, yeah. Yeah. Uh, is there anybody overtaking you, guys? Yeah. yeah. He's off the brake, off the brake, that's it. So, did you use the brake there for that car that was in the road? That grey one, because okay. it just come in. Again, what could happen to these lights? See. Anybody close behind you? No. Again, okay, what can happen with these lights? There. Is there anybody behind you? No. So look, in this kind of situation, if you did have to brake a bit harsher than normal, it would be okay to do that because there's no risk behind. If someone's following you really close behind, would it be safe to do that? No. Otherwise, what would happen? Like them not going to prepare to stop. Good. That's why we check our mirrors before breaking them out, yeah? So, here, yeah, what does this sign tell us? This green sign, you know? The screen. Is it that the road's linked to? Yeah, there's two lanes, but it's got the arrows in there that you can use. Both lanes for straight, and the left one's for left, and the right one's for right, yeah? So, when we pass the lights, yeah, mm -hmm. there's a speed limit sign. Okay. Okay, let's see if you can, uh, as soon as you see it, let me know what the speed limit is, please. Okay. Remember how to use the S. Excellent. You've been holding the clutch well there, game one today, yeah? If you've got a good cleave, obviously the road bend, so you haven't got the yeah. best of views there. Yeah, okay. If you can't see, don't risk it because the traffic coming oncoming traffic, yeah, could be trying, could be coming at quite a high speed. Yeah, mm -hmm. trying to get through the lights. I'm about to use the gas now, Tess. Well done.
Yeah. That's it. That's it. I remember one phrase, you know, when my instructor taught me, you say, where there's a van, there's a man. And I always <laughs> took it in my head that day. Is it safe to speed up now? Yeah. Turn red. What's going to happen to their lights? They're going to go green. That's it.
So even though the lights turn, turn green, it's always uh, vitals will still have a look to the right. Yeah, as you're it's entering it. Right in. Yeah, somebody could be jumping the lights or looking out for any main vehicles <coughs> as well. Yeah. Yeah. So remember how much gas to use. Remember which lane to stay. Oh. <laughs> right next to the tree. Okay, so you know I'm going to ask you to pull, uh, park up in a safe place just here now, yeah? Okay. What's the first thing you're supposed to do? Check my mirrors. Good. And then? Signal. Good. And then? Yeah. Okay. But, here, as soon as I shoot to pull up, here. What, do you realise what you did? Did I start to slow down first? Yeah, you, just, yeah you started to cover the brake. Okay. Yeah. So does covering the brake slow your car down? Okay, so 
remember like they're not gonna know that's it well, you know the reasons yeah okay mm -hmm. um so with that we'll see if you do do it again then i can come in and help you okay, okay. otherwise you think you need help with that um i think i'll remember it for next time cool. I'll leave that to you then how do you think uh, it's going so far better than last week yeah way better way better yeah see you can tell like this is the difference, you know, when you come to your lesson a bit more prepared, yeah. watch the videos, yeah? yeah, okay, like, as soon as I pick you up today, you're like, you know, I've been watching the videos, I'm ready today. Last lesson, you're like... <laughs> <laughs> I'm tired. <laughs> yeah, but th that that makes a big difference. Yeah, uh, to it really the driving does. Lessons. Like, anybody watching as well, guys, when you go for your driving lessons, yeah, even if you haven't got the ultimate driving course, just remember what you, in what you did last lesson with your instructor and what you need to improve on. And it just saves a lot of time going into your lesson with the correct mindset. Okay, like, like Taz has done today. So far, obviously we could like, well, what, halfway through the lesson. This has happened last week. Yeah, last week is going well. But it doesn't matter, even if the lesson goes, like you start making mistakes, it's all a part of learning to drive yeah. anyway, yeah. Okay, so, um, yeah, is there anything that you think could have been better? Um, I think just the first one, maintaining my speed on the roundabout. The first one, what, the right turn? The right turn, yeah. yeah. Apart from that, using the gas, how's that been today? A lot better. Yeah. Yeah, you haven't been afraid. Like you said, you, you watched the um, video that we uploaded, that I uploaded, yeah? Mm -hmm. Last week of, of your own driving and a few of the ultimate driving because you realised what you were doing there. Yeah. And what I kept saying was more gas, more gas, yeah. And it actually um, helps a lot. That's it. Good. Um, yeah, lane discipline. Sticking to your lane. I've been helping you with that. Just a reminder, how's that been going? Better. Yeah, that's been going better as well. So do you think you need my help with the, um, the lane discipline going straight ahead on a roundabout? Um, not as much, no. So should we leave that to you now? Yeah. Yeah, so we'll pass over the responsibility. Right. <coughs> but obviously if something does go wrong, I can come in, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Um, for using the gas, reminding you to use the correct amount of gas. You want me to keep helping you with that or you want to just try it? Try it? Try it? Yeah. Cool. So that's yours as well, so you give me not much to do, yeah. Right turns, um, we'll do some right turns as well, yeah. Um, let's see how that goes, okay. The uh, crossroad that you did, that was pretty good, wasn't it? Yeah. Um, the right turn on the runway, that was a bit too fast, I had to ask you to ease off the gas, yeah. yeah. Okay, do you remember how to do your right turns? Yeah. Yeah. Do you want me to help you out in any way on those? Right turns on roundabouts? Yeah. Um. I think, just remind me, you know when you say, oh, like, have a look, have another look, like, check in. So normally so, ask, is it safe? Yeah. Is it safe? Yeah. You want me to just add that in, yeah? Yeah. Well, anywhere else you want my help? Um, I don't know. I don't think so. Cool. So basically, I'm leaving everything to you, but on right turns. How about the judgement as well? So when we've been approaching the roundabout, I've been like, is it safe? And you've been like, yes, no, yes, no. Yeah, and that's every time you've made the correct judgement. Yeah, that last one was, um, well, the one before this was really good when he said, yes, I can go after that blue car. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. That, that shows that your, improved, your judgment is improving. There's no way, like, before you see a car, you're like, nah, I've got to stop. Yeah. Yeah, so that, that's changing a little bit, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, with that, you want me to still ask you that question or no? Uh, I think just on my judgment. Still ask you about the yeah, judgment. Just okay, just so saying. is it safe to enter and when you're turning right around about, is it safe to move over? Yeah. Or which mirrors? Yeah. yeah, to ask you questions and uh, prompt you prompt you on that, yeah. Cool. Um that's fine then. So you're taking a lot more responsibility now. Yeah? Okay, we'll see how it goes. Don't worry about making mistakes. Yeah, I will come in if, if there is something something dangerous, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. So let's do um, a couple of those right hands that we've been doing before. And then uh, on on roundabouts. See so yeah, how they go. And if they'll we'll change it up a bit again, yeah. yeah. Okay. So we'll move off times whenever you're ready. There's only two cars coming here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's it. Do it now. Good. So, right, if there's only like one or two cars overtaking you, yeah, yeah. Okay. We don't need to do it. Yeah, and why is it not good to signal as they're about to overtake you? Because 
because like, say if they slow down, then they're gonna slow down everyone else behind them. That as well, and they could just think that you're about to move off in front of them. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Obviously, if there's if there's a lot of traffic, yeah, and there's loads of cars coming, you want someone to give you a yeah, then yeah, apply. Always that's why you know when you're making that judgment, think okay, how many cars are there? Yeah, is it just one or two? Yeah. yeah turn right in these traffic lights, please. starting to rain. Mm -hmm. Now the sound quality of the video guys I warn you now it's gonna go uh, a bit a bit bad again especially the sound of the wipers. Do you know how to apply the wipers? This one? Yep. Sure. Yep. Sure. Keep you can switch off now. Take responsibility for that, yeah. here while you're waiting. It's going to help you. That's it. So tell me when you think it's safe. Where's that van and car going now? Yeah. So I could have gone. Yeah, we could have entered that there, yeah. Where's that bus going? No. Which, what no, do you mean this way? Right. Yeah. yeah, it's coming towards us because he had no signal. That's it. Both these cars coming towards us. Yeah. This one's going to Yeah. Can I go after the van? Yeah, it looks like there might be a gap. Where's that red car going? Straight. Yeah, so we can go on there, go on. More gas tests. Well then, good. Got the mirrors 
there, is it safe to move over, you think? Yeah. That's it. Only move over when you're sure. Yeah. So if you're not sure, stay to that side.
safe? Yeah. Good. Another round back coming back. If you can go straight ahead, second exit, please. So let's say you do this round about here. Okay, should we leave it all to you? Next, did I say we're taking? Second. Third. Let's put the gas. Which gear do you need to ask? Keep the flex down, let's change again. Okay, so how's your Moving off with the gas and your lane discipline then? The moving off on my lanes were good, but it was just enough change my gear. So you put the clutch yeah. down and you decided to bring it back up, yeah? Yeah. So I should have left it down. So. Obviously, if the, if the clutch isn't down, will you be able to change your gear? Right. So you're gonna stop up.
at the roundabout by turning right to second exit. Is it safe to enter? <coughs> So that, you know that car that went just turned left here? What could he have done a bit sooner that would have helped us make a decision to go? Put his signal on earlier. Because he left it a bit late. I see, that's why signal was so important, yeah. At this roundabout to left first exit, please. So what's the new speed limit? Okay, again we're on the hill. What could happen to the car now when you try and move off? Could roll back. Could roll back. Okay, you can prevent that happening. You think it's safe? You can now. Okay, so it's still quite a bit of help with the gentleman thing, yeah? So, but can you help with that? Yeah. The light switch on the left is the twister. No, on the left. You twist it forward. Yeah, you don't have to hit it. Take you straight ahead, please. Straight ahead. Richard, it's like two does. Is it safe? Yeah. See, on your part, you want to select that gear, bring it up. If it's not safe, then you can put it back down to stop here. Just it prevents us coasting and prepares us to like go as soon as you see that guy is pressing that thing again. Yeah, 
the engine for me. Okay. That's the end of the lesson. How do you think that went? Um, yes, definitely. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, massive improvement from uh, last lesson. Yeah. Um, the stuff that obviously you've done before, but we just basically recapping yeah. again. Yeah. So you watch the videos, and we worked on the stuff that was going on last lesson. And do you think we improved on it? I think, yeah. How much? A lot. <laughs> it still might be just my judgment a bit. Yes. We're just going to go, go on to that. Yeah. yeah. Still need a bit of help with the judgment, which is absolutely fine. Yeah, see, on the last round, where I said, okay, let's have a go yourself now. Yeah. yeah. You slow down a bit. So it wasn't the last round, but sorry, the, the big one that we went straight in. Yeah. Out, yeah. You slow down a bit too early. You said straight up, maybe you should slow down. That yeah. Way. Good. It's about realizing the faults. Obviously, there, there's no one behind us, so I didn't like coming and say, oh, Speed up for that, yeah. Okay, and you realize it falls straight away. And then the judgment after that, we didn't miss a gap, and then I could come in and you ask him, is it safe? You weren't too sure, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, something we definitely need to um, work on a bit more, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Apart from that, all good now, yeah. I think uh, we should let's move on to something else now, next lesson, yeah. Um, because your general driving, obviously, this is just going to keep improving. It, but yeah. it doesn't matter what subject we do, we're going to continue, obviously. Doing big roundabouts, yeah. general driving. Yeah. Just looking out for signs more. Yeah, I'll see. As you get more comfortable, we're gonna, we are going to start more sign following. Yeah. Well, yeah. So next le well. That's it. Next lesson, though. Um, maneuvers, because we've only done the one maneuver. Yeah. Yeah, and we haven't done it in this car yet. You know, the uh, we did the reverse yeah. yeah. Um, we'll recap on that. Yeah. Um, but also, let's um, do the. Reverse parallel parking. Okay. okay. So, what, what are you going to do for next lesson? Watch both those videos. That's it. Yeah, so the, you know the videos in the ultra driving course explain exactly how to do it, show you the pointers that we use. Yeah. Yeah. Obviously, you know when people are experienced, they don't really need pointers and that, yeah. Okay. But when they're first learning, <coughs> learning how to do it, um, most people do require um, reference points. But if you feel you can do without reference points, fine. Yeah. But I would advise you to watch the video so you know exactly where I mean by the reference point. It's going to save us a lot of time. Again. Yeah. yeah. That's the whole point of the auto driving course. Okay. So please watch those and prepare for the next lesson. Yeah. yeah. But really good lesson, Taz. Really good lesson. Okay, guys. So, um, like always, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and, subs uh, like and subscribe. And we'll see you in the next video.